There are wild creatures which require still water inland. So, for all of time before European humans arrived in North America, those creatures depended on beavers. One of our early achievements as we occupied the continent was the extermination of the beavers. The U.S. Soil Conservation Service stepped in with the slogan, Hold the raindrop where it falls. They built farm ponds in a feeble attempt to replace the massive waterworks of the beavers. Some of those farm ponds still provide inland refuge. A group of water birds called the dabbling ducks feed by grazing in shallow, still waters of just the type created by the beavers and the Soil Conservation Service. The gadwall and the American widgeon are dabbling ducks, and the American widgeon has a cousin which occupies Europe, Asia, and Africa called the Eurasian widgeon. In recent decades, the Eurasian widgeon has established a foothold in North America, wintering along the Atlantic and Pacific coasts. Those wintering in the east are believed to breed in Iceland. Western birds visit from Siberia. All the Eurasian widgeons reported wintering in eastern North America today stay strictly along the Atlantic coast, with one exception, a small cluster on an inland farm pond in the Shenandoah Valley. Until the beavers return, to manage the inland waters, we have the Soil Conservation Service to thank for a look at a far-ranging traveler.